welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a first impression on the Trader Joe's Rich Hydrating Face Sheet Mask. And this is a new product that Trader Joe's recently started carrying, so I thought I would share with you guys how I like it. I have not used this yet, and so I'm gonna go ahead and read you guys the directions before I start, so that way we're all on the same page. The directions are as stated. Cleanse face and dry thoroughly. Remove mask from the packet and peel off the film liner. Apply mask gently over your face and smooth the mask to ensure good, <laughs> to ensure good skin contact. Leave on and relax for up to 20 minutes. Remove and pat any remaining serum into the skin. Optionally, apply face moisturizer for maximum hydration. Use daily, weekly, monthly, or as needed for an extra hydration boost. So the first step, obviously, is going to have me remove all of my makeup and then make sure my skin is nice and cleansed. And then I'm going to go ahead and start by applying this mask. So I'll see you guys in a second. I'm going to take all this makeup off. All right guys, so I just finished removing my makeup, but I thought I would share with you guys what I use to re remove all my makeup. The first step I do is this Pacifica Coconut Dissolve Cleansing Oil. And I love this stuff. As you can tell, it's almost empty. I have another bottle in reserve. So I use about three to five pumps and I massage my face really well, including my eye area and my lips. Once I'm finished, massaging this into my face. I use this magic eraser. It's, it looks like this. It's a really long cloth, but I will use this to remove all of the excess oil and the rest of my makeup from my face and my eyes. And this thing works amazingly. So with these two things combined, my makeup is completely gone. Then I go ahead and cleanse my face with this Pacifica Seafoam Complete Face Wash. This is also um, helpful in removing makeup, but I like it because it's very non-harsh and abrasive. It's just basically a cleanser. There's nothing to scrub your face with. So I feel like it doesn't dry my face out too much, but when I do go weeks wearing makeup, I tend to wash my face more often and my face gets really dry. So I am excited to use this face sheet mask. So let's go ahead and apply this to my face. Okay guys, so here I go, opening this up. Very easy to open. Mmm, it smells like cucumbers. Okay, so it says to Remove mask from the packet and peel off the film liner. Okay. Woo. All right. Okay, it looks like this is the film liner. So I'm going to remove that. Apply gently over face and smooth the mask to ensure good skin contact. Okay, so this definitely smells like cucumbers, like very refreshing scent. It's definitely not overwhelming and I'm very sensitive to smell. So having it right under my nose isn't driving me nuts, at least yet. <laughs> oh wow, okay, so immediately I'm getting some tingling sensation above my lip right here. Not too bad, it's just a light tingle, almost a warm sensation starting to warm up even more. Wow, oh my goodness. It is really warm. Everything, everywhere else felt, feels like nice and cool, but above my lip is really where it's starting to tingle. Hmm, interesting. Okay, well I have 20 minutes to go have some water, sit down, feed my son. <laughs> I will get back to you guys as soon as I am done. Hopefully, this is gonna turn out well. <laughs> Check in point, guys. It's been about seven minutes, and that 
burning slash tingle sensation is gone and it wasn't like unbearable or anything it just was like you know a tingle slash burn <laughs> um but yeah so far it nothing feels like that anymore it's nice and cooling and it's just really hard to talk and try not to laugh or smile when you're wearing one of these because it's really hard it means a lot anyways i'm just enjoying my sparkling water Okay guys, it's been about 20 minutes, so I am going to remove this, but I am going to tell you, since this is a first impression, this part of my lip has dried, so it's kind of like flapping in the wind, and other parts are still wet, like around my side of my face, but kind of the middle part has dried a bit, so just let me know the real deal. So I'm going to remove this. Oh my gosh, this feels great. Oh, and then it says to rub it in, so I'm just going to rub in the remaining products. Oh my gosh, my skin feels so refreshed right now. It feels like really clean and soft and like just, I think that cooling effect really helps just kind of tighten my skin a lot. I think that's what it is. It's like tightened and moisturize. It feels fabulous. Wow. Okay. Well, I definitely will be getting another one of these because these sheet masks are really pricey at other stores like Sephora and Ulta. They sell them everywhere now, but I um, think Trader Joe's price point at $1.99 is incredible and especially for how great my face feels. So I think I'm going to be getting another one of these and probably a lot more to come. I'm hoping they keep these in stock. So hopefully this video helped you guys out. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.